Steve McQueen, a timeless figure in the entertainment world, is admired for qualities that have made him a lasting symbol. His charm on screen, natural talent, and ability to connect with audiences make him stand out in movie history. Many people remember the first time they saw his work showing how much he influenced viewers. What makes McQueen unforgettable isn't just one great performance, but the characters he played and the memorable moments he created that people of all ages can relate to. Have you ever thought back to the first time you saw him in a movie? Share your favorite memory or experience with this famous actor in the Kamalime Trends below. As we learn more about his life, get ready for some interesting, surprising, and touching facts that will keep you interested. There's still a lot to learn about the man we know as Steve McQueen. Steve McQueen, a timeless icon in the world of entertainment, has left a lasting impact on cinema. His charm, talent, and ability to connect with audiences make him unforgettable. Many people fondly recall their first encounter with his work, demonstrating his enduring influence. What sets McQueen apart isn't just one outstanding performance, but the characters he brought to life and the moments he crafted. Have you ever thought back to your initial experience watching his films? McQueen's list of movies includes various notable projects. For those new to his work, delving into must-watch films is an excellent beginning. Classics like The Great Escape, where he excels as Captain Virgil Hiltz, or Bullet, where he defines the role of Frank Bullet, showcase his talent and charisma. Another essential watch is The Magnificent Seven, where he's part of an ensemble cast in this Western masterpiece. For newcomers, these films provide a glimpse into his captivating performances and cinematic presence. So, whether you're a longtime fan or just discovering his films, exploring McQueen's essential movies promises an engaging cinematic journey. In Le Mans, Steve McQueen took charge, clashing with director John Sturges over the film's direction. While Sturges aimed for a conventional script emphasizing racer relationships and a Hollywood ending, McQueen envisioned a racing documentary with minimal dialogue, putting the focus on the cars. Inspired by European art house dramas, particularly Claude Lelouch's A Man and a Woman, McQueen's vision led to a significant production rift, marking the end of his collaboration with Sturges. The departure of Sturges was bluntly attributed to, I am too old and rich to put up with this stuff. In Baby the Rain Must Fall, McQueen played Henry Thomas. Notably, Josephine Hutchinson, billed fifth, had a brief on-screen presence without any lines lasting about five seconds. The Getaway showcased McQueen as Doc McCoy, and during a bank heist escape, an orange Volkswagen Beetle driven by James Garner appears. Garner, initially on set as a visitor, joined the film due to his driving skills coordinated by stunt expert Kerry Lofton. A subtle inconsistency occurs when the same Beetle is spotted parked moments earlier as Doc and Carol flee the scene. These anecdotes shed light on McQueen's assertive approach to film filmalantraking and the interesting behind-the-scenes dynamics, adding depth to his cinematic journey. In his heyday at Warner Brothers, he harbored aspirations of ascending to stardom, an ambition that ultimately led him down an unexpected path into the realm of lesser-known poverty row films in the later stages of his career. A standout moment in this cinematic journey was his portrayal of Kenny Veach in the film Whistle Stop, where his close companion Mac Gray made memorable cameo appearances in support of Raph's endeavors. The intricacies of his tough roles and the nuances of his performances are thoughtfully explored by Karen Burroughs Hansbury in her book Bad Boys, The Actors of Film Noir. Amidst the undulating waves of success and setbacks, he encountered pivotal moments that shaped his trajectory, ranging from turning down roles to facing bands fueled by alleged connections. Despite these challenges, the indomitable spirit of his tough guy persona remained unwavering, leaving an enduring impact on Hollywood's portrayal of anti-heroes. A rugged existence defined his journey, characterized by a series of compelling portrayals that etched an indelible mark on the annals of the film industry. The legacy of his robust characters endures, influencing subsequent generations of actors and shaping the very fabric of cinematic storytelling. In retrospect, his life unfolds as a compelling narrative of resilience, determination, and artistic Kamala treatment, showcasing the unpredictable twists and turns inherent in the world of entertainment. Through thick and thin, he remained a formidable force, navigating the complexities of an industry that both embraced and challenged him. This multifaceted journey serves as a testament to the enduring nature of his contributions, forever etching his name into the cinematic chronicles. Thus concludes the captivating story of a man whose cinematic legacy transcends the real world, 
leaving an indomitable imprint on the hearts and minds of movie enthusiasts. George Raff's impact, both on and off screen, is a testament to the enduring power of storytelling and the indelible mark left by those who dare to defy conventions. This narrative, shaped by triumphs and trials, stands as a testament to the resilience of a Hollywood icon whose name will forever be synonymous with the golden age of cinema. Steve McQueen, a prominent figure in the film world, stands out not just for his charm on screen, but also when compared to others of his time. When you look at him alongside his peers, you can see how special he is. His bold approach to making movies, like his clashes with directors such as John Sturges, shows he wanted things to feel real. Unlike most Hollywood movies, McQueen saw projects like Le Mans as documentaries about racing, not just regular stories. A big moment in his career happened during his time at Warner Brothers when he was aiming for stardom and ended up in unexpected roles. Even when he faced setbacks and took on roles in less famous films later on, McQueen's tough guy image stayed strong. One noteworthy role was as Kenny Veach in Whistle Stop, where you could see how good he was at acting out complex characters. In Karen Burroughs Hansberry's book Bad Boys, the actors of film noir, she looks at McQueen's tough roles and performances, giving us a deeper understanding of his work. This helps us see how determined he was to succeed in an industry full of challenges. He isn't just remembered for the characters he played, but also for how he inspired later generations of actors. McQueen's life is a gripping story of resilience, determination, and dedication to his craft as he navigated the ups and downs of showbiz. His lasting mark on the film world shows how powerful storytelling can be even today. He's a Hollywood icon whose influence goes beyond the screen, proving the enduring importance of movies in our culture. In the Spanish version of the movie Bullet, there was an interesting change. The part where the main character, Detective Lieutenant Frank Bullet, says a certain word to another character was edited out. Although you can see the actor's lips moving, the actual word was removed. This added a unique touch to the character's expression. When he was young, he had some trouble and got into arguments with his stepfather. He even got involved in stealing things. But in 1944, he was sent to a place called the California Junior Republic for Boys at Chino. He later said that this experience really helped him get back on track. During the filming of Tom Horn in 1980, he decided to quit smoking right before they started shooting. This affected his appearance a bit, making him look different due to the sudden change in his diet. This shows how dedicated he was to his work, willing to change personal habits for a role. These stories from his life show that he was more than just an actor. He had a troubled past, but he also had experiences that helped him grow. And he was complimented to his work, even making sacrifices for it. These details add depth to the image people have of him.